U.S. women's ice hockey team provided one of the most dramatic moments of the Olympics so far. A shootout win over rival Canada gave the American women their first gold medal since 1998 and ended the Canadians' 24-game Olympic winning streak. The 2018 Olympics were an international affair for the Brandt family of Minnesota. Hannah Brandt helped Team USA to the gold medal, while her adopted sister Marissa, who was born in South Korea, represented the unified Korean team. Dana Jacobson sat down with the sisters to discuss their Olympic experiences. Yeah, it was an incredible feeling being able to be here with my sister. I kind of imagined what it would be like coming into it, but to actually be able to live it out and do it with her was one of the most incredible feelings ever. I didn't even know what to expect going into the Olympics and what it would be like, but now that it's almost over, it's sad, but we had so much fun together and with our teams, and yeah, we, I don't know, couldn't have asked for anything different. Opening ceremony, different teams, but did you get a chance to see each other at least? Yes, for a short time. My team was really late for some, <laughs> some reason. There was lots of traffic, so got in right away and then looked for the USA sign and found her, took a picture, and then we said bye. Yeah, I was kind of sad because I was like, oh, I'm not going to see her. Like, I was kind of texting, like, you need to get here now. Like, and then I didn't hear from her, and all of a sudden, we're about to walk outside. Um, and out of nowhere, she appeared, and I, was, I got a little emotional just because I, to actually see her at the opening ceremonies and um, to have that, like, dream come true for both of us is pretty exciting. Hannah, obviously for you, this was the gold medal that you all sought. Can you take me into what it was like for you and for your team you're, I mean, you get to overtime, you go to a shootout. What was that shootout like for you guys on the ice? It felt like we had a lot of confidence going into the overtime. We were playing well, we had come from behind. Um, and then for it to go into a shootout, we just kind of were like, well, we got to do this now. Like that cool, that relaxed. Yeah, I mean, you can't overthink it at that point. Um, it, it's just a shootout. We do those all the time. And uh, obviously this one meant a little bit more, but you have to kind of stay calm, cool and collected. I don't know if it's quite sunk in yet, but it's definitely a dream come true for all of us, and it's just been fun to experience that with my teammates. Can you take us into that moment, right that second when you knew that the U.S. had won? What was that like for the Brandt family in the stands? Yeah, we were all sitting together, and we were actually with some of my teammates, and I just remember she made the save. We all screamed, and then we ran down because we wanted to be, like, we wanted to try and see you and be with other parents, but it was just excitement, pure excitement and joy and happiness for her team, and that they finally won gold. It was stressful to watch just because, you know, yeah, it was very back and forth and like you said, went into overtime and then a shootout. So I was on the edge of my seat the entire time, just nervous for her and her team, but they won and it was complete, just, yeah, so happy and relieved that it was over and she could just <laughs> celebrate and yeah, very happy and proud. I know you guys spent about, what, two years where you guys really weren't in the same place as a family, not just you, but with your parents. One of your sponsors helped bring you together, Intel. How did they do that? Intel was awesome. They came and shot both of us um, in our respective training locations. Hey, Mom. Hi, Mom. But for us to be able to kind of share our story with our family and friends that hadn't really seen a whole lot of us. Even when you're not there, I know that I always have something to play for, and that's you guys. Uh, it was incredible the way they put that together. What do you think the impact was on girls in America, in Korea, from seeing you guys play hockey? I've already heard from so many people back home, uh, people tweeting at us um, that we've inspired many, many people to start playing hockey. I think we've generated a lot of new fans and I think for us to be able to do that, that's, that's what we're here to do. We want to spread the game, we want to be role models for little girls back home and I think that we were able to do that. Right on, Brant sisters. They, sure, they sure did become role models. Wow, and what a great experience for two sisters. Unbelievable. Like that. Really, really exciting.